Doctor who actually treats women with breast cancer has a survival story of her own. What does she say to look out for? Sam Luther found out it doesn't always need to be a trip to the doctor. But it's definitely a fear of all women. A breast cancer diagnosis is a reality for one in eight women, according to Dr. Lindsay Luttrell at Covenant Health, who four years ago dealt with it herself. This was while I was treating patients. So I lost all my hair. Um, I still was going to work and treating breast cancer patients. A radiologist at Methodist Medical Center in Oak Ridge, now cancer free, saying it helped bond with patients. I think it just added a whole layer of understanding of what our breast, pan breast cancer patients go through and just how challenging it is from a physical level, but also emotional. Um, it is just such a really tough journey. She says if you're over 40, you should come in every year to get a mammogram, but you can do things at home to be safe. Uh, things to look out for would be a, a lump or a mass or any kind of nipple discharge or skin thickening or redness, anything that's not normal for you or symmetric to the other side should definitely be evaluated. Having a relative that's had breast cancer can nearly double your risk of a diagnosis as an East Tennessee doctor pushes for people to be diligent and get routine checks. And our whole goal of screening mammography is to detect cancers when they're so tiny that there are no symptoms. In Knoxville, Sam Luther, WVLT News. Well, screenings, mammograms are the number one way to detect breast cancer.